Wow, check out Pete, huh? Didn't even wear a wetsuit. Time for your pinpoint weather and traffic. Together we say good morning to TJ. It was perfect beach weather yesterday. It was right? absolutely perfect. You had a, you know, tons of sunscreen and you're fine <laughs> yesterday. Oh, my goodness. Anything but. But, uh, you know, yeah. we're, we're looking at uh, some chilly temperatures uh, right now still. Relatively speaking, 38 degrees. That's not a bad way to start the day, I suppose. We are looking at lots of clouds overhead. I think we're going to be seeing a little bit of sunshine. Keep in mind that... Sunrise is an hour later today compared to what it was while well, Saturday morning. And we're going to be seeing uh, probably a little bit of sunshine when the sun does pop up. And then I think we'll see more in the way of clouds throughout the rest of the day. Live City Camp picture showing not a whole bunch out there. It's quiet, 39 degrees with a wind from the northwest at 6. Emerald Bay, Cumberland, 37 degrees. That's the morning low. Winds are calm over there in Cumberland. And they'll be turning into the northeast throughout the day. Tough wind direction when you want to warm up, especially when you have lots of clouds around. Cool, calm, and cloudy. Over there in Pawtucket, according to Ray and Tina, they've got 37 degrees. 36 Smithfield, 33 degrees over there in westerly southeastern Mass. Waking up to 39, 40 degrees this morning. The satellite radar picture showing lots of clouds around, especially up there in uh, northern New England. We'll see some of that cloudiness kind of spin on down our way throughout the course of the day. And we're also going to be stuck with a northeasterly wind, which tends to bring in some moisture, especially to the uh, low and mid-levels of the atmosphere. And we're going to be seeing this cold front pushing offshore throughout the day. And we'll see some slightly cooler temperatures come in as a result. Notice some rain off to our west. Some of that rain will get into the northeast, but not today, not tomorrow. On Wednesday, we'll see some rain working its way in. Probably a, a, a rainy day expected for uh, Wednesday, pretty much the whole day. High pressure will be trying to build in throughout the day, but out ahead of it, we're going to be seeing northeasterly winds bring in the cool and damp air off of the Atlantic Ocean. Now, your Tuesday, we'll see more in the way of sunshine as drier air associated with the center of high pressure gets a little bit closer, and we're going to be seeing uh, slightly warmer temperatures as a result of the extra sun. Sunshine. Your morning commute, I think you'll catch a little sunshine, especially near the south shore, but mainly cloudy with a sprinkle possible temperatures in the 30s. In the afternoon, not warming up a whole bunch. 40 in Central Falls, 41 on the east side of Providence. Rumford about 40 degrees on over into Barrington and Warren about 40. Mainly cloudy, 41 degrees in Warwick. You catch a little sunshine along the south shore this morning, and then tending to cloud up throughout the rest of the day. Lower 40s along the south shore. Up in northern Rhode Island, mainly cloudy, cool and dry, and outside of a, a sprinkle dry. 40 in Greenville, 41 in Hope, southeastern Massachusetts, upper 30s to lower 40s out here throughout the afternoon. Seven-day future cast. Tuesday looking good, 47 degrees with sunshine. Rain on Wednesday. Thursday, probably the best day of the week. Lots of sunshine, 55. We cloud up on Friday, 57 degrees. A little milder Friday, but extra clouds around. Shower Friday night, Saturday and Sunday looking good. Temperatures in the low 50s with sunshine. Tony Petrarca will have your updated future cast later today. On Eyewitness News Live at 5, let's get an update now.